going on people hope y'all doing fantastic all right let, i'm out here working on the trailer so i'll just give a quick tour um here is a 1991 great dane stainless steel reefer trailer we got stainless steel doors stainless steel sides we got lights up top on the top up here lights down here there's some more lights up under there lights on the side over here another row of lights on the top over there same on the other side and up here on the front around the top there across the front there's more lights up there lots of lights all over the place but uh, a little bit more lights than what i like but it is what it is look more lights up under here so it's a spread axle um all the hardware and stuff and bushings are good up under here so the guy that had it before me took very good care of it um let's open the door so this is what the inside looks like got the vent there's one up there one over here and there's one behind me uh, the floor does need a patch right here and about right there needs a patch right there nothing serious so back in the day this was top of the line so i got the old truck so got to keep up with the old truck so we got a the truck is a 90 so the trailer is a 91 so the trailer is newer than the truck um so it has an old unit on there which you probably already saw the video a carrier thunderbird plus is what they call it um not too much concerned about whether if it uh is salvageable or not because i can pull that off and there's plenty of people around here in my area that work on them or i can find another like a thermo king unit one of the little uh sb3s or sb2s or something like that it's so it's, it's not not really a big deal to me and i can pull the trailer as a dry van itself until you know it generates the revenue to get the the unit operating properly but here's the unit now to give you an idea of what one of these costs new now this is a 91 now i saw one of these on a bank repo list i went to the bank and went to their repo list or equipment for sale list where they have repos and they had a trailer very similar stainless steel sides stainless steel doors stainless steel front spread axle um i think it had the light package i'm not sure i don't remember and the only thing it was a 53 foot and it was a repo the price on that was ninety thousand dollars so you get one of these new that's what it costs well, how much did yours cost, brother, man? Well, it costs a fraction of that price. When I say a fraction, I mean a fraction. I'll put it to you this way. The most high is good. I could sell. These are brand new tires. Came with Trailer came with brand new tires. Eight brand new tires. I could sell the tires and the rims for what I paid for the trailer and recoup my money. So... That's what this is. I'm not scared of old equipment because I have connections with people that know how to work on it, uh, work on it myself. And uh, it's just part of trucking. So, hope you guys enjoy the video. This is the trailer. So as soon as we get that floor patch, we're gonna keep on riding. We'll see you.